tutorial, we're learning about a new note, B. Now, there's a couple of ways you can play B. I mean, you could just scoot your thumb down, right? You could just scoot it down to B. We've done that before. But what about crossing your two over? Why would you want to do that in piano? Well, the reason why they don't talk about this in the book is because it can help you have a smooth legato sound. If you play C, B, C with all thumbs, you have to lift up your thumb to move it to B, no matter how good you are, no matter how quick, it's still moving. If I keep my thumb on C, I can hold it down until the very instant my two is ready to play B. And so that's what I'm doing now on the pronto prep box. I'm on the first line. I'm playing one crossover two one. Then I return to the home position again. One crossover two one, and then one crossover two one two three. On the next line, I'm playing one two one two one two one two one two one two one. And on the last line, three four three two one two three four five one. Three, two, one, two, is B, one, three, two, one, two, one. So you're just practicing these little crossover parts, which will make playing the British Grenadiers much easier. Go ahead and try it now.